Hi, my name is Paul Piskosz and I am Precise Engineer at Storeware. During this session, I'm going to present what change has been made in Storeware Backup and Recovery 5.1. In case of backup, but what is most important here, in case of restore virtual environments in Oracle Linux Virtualization Manager. So, let's dive into it. So, let's start and log into uh, Storeware Backup and Recovery. In case of Oracle Linux Virtualization Manager, first you need to add your hypervisor manager. How to do it? I will show you. Virtual Environments and Infrastructure tab. And now you can use Create button. Then choose a type. For the list, select OLVM here. Now you need to provide several information. First, URL, where, is where your Oracle Linux is located. Username can be admin and password for that username. Then you need to choose a proper strategy. Uh, depend on your environment. In my case, it will be disk image transfer. And basically, that's all. So you need to save your configuration. I already did that and I backed my machine. So let's find this one. In Instant Tab, I'm going to use filters and select proper policy. In this case, RHV. My machine is done and up backup is up to date, so let's try do a restore here. First change is here. Restore to hypervisor manager. To better look, I'm going to change the cluster for default one and now I'm going to show you the changes. Customize disk layout. Now you can select the proper storage where you are going to restore uh, this uh, image and you can change a format allocation. Also, now it's possible to rename your disk uh, during the restoration process. Second one, instant restore. Yeah, it's finally here uh, in two ways. First, you can instant restore specific image in our staging space, I mean the temporary space, so in our node, and you can also use the live migration, so the data from our node will be in live uh, moved into Oracle Linux Virtualization Manager. And after select this, this one, you can use the restore button. You can easily test that improvement in your environment. If you need help during the update, contact our support or visit our website at storeware.eu. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.